All right. Hello, everyone. I wanted to quickly go over how to embed Desmos into um, Canvas quizzes. So I'm going to go ahead and add a new quiz. And then make a title. And go ahead and start building. So what I like to do here is I'm going to go ahead and add something here. I like to add the calculator as a stimulus for the questions that I want um, the calculator. All right. So Desmos is going to be on the left hand side and then I can add all my questions on the right hand side that they can use the calculator on. And then you can add a new question if you don't want it to have the Desmos calculator. So I'm going to embed the star version. So um, you can just Google uh, Desmos star Texas. It's usually the first one to come up here. And this is the star version. And so I'm going to go ahead and copy that URL. And then what I'm going to do is um, open up iframe generator you can just google iframe generator it's the first one to pop up it's iframe-generator.com i'll put it in the details below um, and so this creates an iframe which i can embed within canvas so i paste i copied that url from my desmos calculator i'm going to paste it in here and generate and you can preview it if you want see what it looks like there there's some settings border and things like that if you want to add those so I'm going to go ahead and copy that and I'm going to go back into canvas. And so what I'm going to do is I'm going to insert uh, media and then embed. And now I can embed that iframe. One thing I always like to change is the width. I'm going to go ahead and make that a hundred percent. So it takes up a hundred percent of the width. Um, and then now my height, you can mess around with that, but I'm going to put it at 500 just to start off to see how that goes. Okay, so now it's embedded. Here you can see that here. And it's too large. You can change those settings that I was playing with and the stimulus. And you'll see it be on, it'll be on the left-hand side, and then you can attach questions on the right-hand side so students are able to use the calculator here. You can also embed that iframe that we created into any page, any um, assignment, or anything like that, discussion questions, you can embed this calculator within that. And that's how you embed it.